Well, beloved Dub Dub! Simpsons, it's the Simpsons, it's the greatest show in history. Though it should have ended after season 14. Oh, dear God, no! So we're definitely quite well balanced here because of the first 20 years of the show, I've seen every episode multiple times Of course, the show's now been on 30 years, or 31 years this year. Peter, you've seen most episodes of the 90s era? I'd say it was more mid-90s to... Golden era to Star of Decline. Yeah. George, how many episodes of The Simpsons have you seen? Definitely less than 15, I'd say probably around like 8 maybe. I know a few references because I'm friends with them. And because it's really hard to escape them. Dental plan! Lisa needs braces. Dental plan! Lisa needs braces. <laughs> Dental plan! Lisa needs braces. Nine hundred dollar dues! They're gonna take my dumps! We're in a hubba bubba nightmare. The Simpsons should have ended at least ten years ago. Inevitably, it's been declining in quality. It's been going now for 30 years. They're beating a dead horse with a dead horse. This isn't letting it die gracefully. No! Is it just because it makes too much money through stuff like Tapped Out? Well, with Tapped Out, that was the reason they haven't made another video game like, oh, they don't um, like Simpsons Hit and Run. <laughs> started watching the show, it was the end of series eight. I would have been in eight, nine, ten. <sighs> Sometime around there. It was on at like 6 p.m. On BBC Two? BBC Two, yeah, after the weakest link. After the weakest link and before Fresh Prince of Bel Air. That's it. Now this is a story all about. Ah! And then when it got to the end of season 12, for many years I thought that's when the show stopped, because it got to season 12 and they didn't have any new episodes. So then they went back and next week it was start from series 2. It was so, so weird that when they sort of thought the first early episode having seen the newer ones at the time. We had like a few family VHSs or maybe early DVDs. So I remember once my brother said, wouldn't it be funny if we watched it in Dutch? I was like, not really. Hoofdopzichter, ik hoop dat er zitten watertanden voor hamburgers. En je noemt ze stoomhamma ook al zijn ze heel ruidelijk gegrild. Ja. Yeah. Here it says 200th episode of season yep. 9. Mm -hmm. Do you know what season it was for have 100th episode? Season 5. Yeah. 5, okay. Yeah. So how many episodes do you have a season? About 22, 24. It's between 20 and 25. Yeah. The only exception is series 1 where they did 13 episodes. Slap your faces on mugs, t-shirts, candy, lunch boxes, board games, gum, novelty flying discs, and fluffy fluffy beach towels. Did you have a lot of Simpson merch growing up? Negative. Oh, Simpson comics. I had Simpson comics. I had a big pile. I have a small pile. A Simpsons poster was bought for me. Yeah, I had Simpson posters, some clothing, and a Bart Simpson pencil case for many years. Benson! <laughs> Autism. I had a Bart Simpson DS holder. How about video games? Hit and run. Hello! I need you to go out and buy eggs for Bart! <laughs> and go buy eggs for Bart! I think right. everyone agrees that is one of the best games of all time. Yeah. It's right next to uh, Dr. Robotnik's Mean Beam Machine. Yeah! And that game is the only time in my life where I've actually been ahead with video games. At school, everyone couldn't get past the final level. It was difficult, but I seemed to get through it before everyone else. Oh god, I still haven't finished the game! I've played it three times now. I've got to <laughs> check myself. You, video games, up to date? <laughs> This was back in 2005. Road Rage? Fuck Matt off. Groening played Crazy Taxi in Fortnite. Yeah, I'll do that! Premium! Dude! I also have the Simpson game. I'm March! The point of this video is to compare the current Simpsons to the classic Simpsons. Which would be interesting for me because I know very little of the show. But most of the stuff I know is just because hearing pop culture and that kind of thing, seeing a few clips here and there. Did you get any like from a rating system or like Metacritic or something like that? I looked at the last five years of the show comparing them with what they're rated on IMDb and TV.com and then I looked at the first eight years of the show. The only episodes during the 90s which are rated negatively are the clip shows. Remember when your Aunt Selma got married? Soon. 
soon I will kill you. I did like the one with Troy McClure one, where he's in the house. This past summer, all of America was trying to solve the mystery of who shot Mr. Burns. Then they found out it was the baby. I think the worst rated episode is the clip show which is all their musical numbers. Yeah. I remember seeing it a few times and I get annoyed and skip over it. They keep getting interrupted by Snake. Uh oh, I'll be back when I get some ammo. Bye. There's not much I can add to this conversation, right? When I looked up the critically better episodes made in the last few years, one of the ones that came up was Gone Boy, a recent episode featuring Sideshow Bob which is the only episode made in the last five years that I've actually seen because I watched it when I did my character chronicles on Sideshow Bob a couple of years ago. Seeing how that was the worst episode of The Simpsons I've ever seen, I thought, if that's one of the better ones made recently... Oh shit. Yeah, let's watch some Simpsons. All right. right. No electricity. Smart. Let's see you solve the maze. Let me at it. Hmm, predictable. Do you guys remember that thing that happened in 2007? Because we did. I thought this was supposed to be in the 90s. In the timeline of this is all fucked up. <gasps> what is that noise? It's rewinding. You should not on oh the Well, this could be fun. Let's watch it. We got him. How come all our father son activities involve getting a TV back on? What about the time I watched you get out of that thing? You mean when I was born? That was fun. <laughs> <laughs> Did Flanders ever remarry? Possible death to who? Edna Garoppolo? And then the yeah, actress died. They established that she died, yes. Okay. They didn't make a big episode about it. Maybe if I keep refreshing, it'll come back. Refresh, 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 refresh. <sighs> That's this an episode of Family Guy? You're gonna see the one thing everyone's afraid of. Death and dead people. That's right, buddy. Wow, that was uncharacteristically dark. Your nightmare begins. <laughs> They're sitting in the background the newspaper and, hmm, should probably do something about that. <gasps> Blood Flanders! Oh, no, it's a Bible. These days there are no more loony bins. All those people are on the streets. So how can I help you? <laughs> Thank you, Bart. Now I can move on. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> so I guess this is now a parody of the sixth sense. The man who caused my death. Hey, oh boy. Fire! I couldn't even do it in widescreen. Oh, yeah. <laughs> they didn't even want to make it. You weren't supposed to die. It was it was just supposed to scare you. This is a prank, dude. Oh, Got him. Man was not meant to live beyond the age of 39. He's 39? Yeah. He's been 39 for, what, 20 years? He looks way old. Mm. Wow. That was dark. <laughs> That would have been better if he drank it. No, I'm the yeah. evil king. That was a bit shit. It was a bit shit. <laughs> yeah, it, that's that's the best they can offer nowadays. The ending with all the deaths was funny. The first five minutes dragged and the real wasn't any laughs in it. The Tracy Almond show. Well, I had my fill. The whole technology thing. I found that to be quite cringy. See, we're modern now, everyone. The yeah. internet. And Look, what's VHS? But yet they had VHS players in the old series. No, we're fine. Day the Simpsons Died, as a lot of people like to coin it. Principal and the Pauper. This is an episode I've actually heard quite a bit about. Yeah. Uh, which is the one where it's revealed that Skinner isn't Skinner. So why was this considered one of the worst episodes? Probably because they just ripped up a piece of the truth or something. You took a supporting character who'd been with the show since the beginning and said he's been an, an imposter. The entire time. He said he was in the Vietnam War, which he was. Every night I wake up screaming. Well, people like to pinpoint this, and there was a video that we saw a while ago that was like the day The Simpsons died, and they blamed this episode because it's the start of season nine, and people like to say, oh, the show should have ended after series eight. I would say that series nine and ten are still part of the classic golden era, and even eleven and twelve, they're good. 
Yeah, these are good. <laughs> the plot's become more Homer being a jackass. I can't believe this over the top thing happened. And then it sort of gets out of control. <laughs> What am I, a tailor? The teacher's lounge is for teachers, Willie. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Make way for one. My theory is, Skinner likes dog food. <laughs> What's so special about tonight? Nothing! Now put on your special suit and get in the car! Yes, Mother. The special suit, that's the suit you wear every day. When I grow up, I want to be a principal or a caterpillar. Since 77, I've been making sneakers at gunpoint in a sweatshop in Wuhan. That's not a funny story. Well, I guess you had to be there. <laughs> Sergeant Skinner took me under his wing and showed me that life is worth living. This is where we're going to drop napalm with these people. <laughs> if a man pretending to be me could do it, well then, logically, the real me must be far more qualified. Good enough. I'm in yeah. Up yours, children. <laughs> He's a war hero. <laughs> no one will ever mention it again. Under penalty of torture. <laughs> Yay! Well, from now on, you're gonna see a new Seymour Skinner. Oh, no, we won't. Yes, Mother. <laughs> Worst episode ever, apparently. I think we can all agree that the principal and the purple. Wow, that was, that was much better. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Harry Shearer, the voice actor of Skinner, said, Oh, this is wrong, this is terrible. I'll still do it, pay me. One of the last episodes of season eight was Homer's Enemy. And when that episode came out, I had more or less the same reaction because people thought, you're having someone come into the show to point out the flaws of it. How on earth can Homer Simpson afford to have a large house, two cars, his wife doesn't work, he's got three children. Yeah. So people were critical of that episode, but then gradually they changed their minds and now it's regarded as being one of the very best ones. Yeah. Whereas Prince and Papa hasn't had that. Swagalicious. Keep looking shut and move slowly towards the cake. the first Halloween episodes that wasn't a Treehouse of Horror. It's a Halloween episode that was canon. Oh, so they can't have people dying. Yeah, exactly. You stored the plastic skeletons too close to the furnace. Yeah, I'll take it to the old folks home and tell Grandpa it's his new roommate. Everyone in the car! <laughs> we can get a costume for the dog. Nothing says you love a pet like letting him be part of the human fun. Yeah, wow, well, her voice is gone. She must be 70 by now. I'm March. Is this a real? Is this a real? Is this a real? Hands <gasps> <laughs> more, man. Sir. We have located and are removing the baby that thinks this is real. Oh, I am the lizard queen. <laughs> Thank you, Grace. <laughs> Just to reassure those who are afraid of pirates. Oh, no. You know how sensitive she is. You don't want her to go back to, to Haley. No, she wouldn't. She couldn't. Not Taylor. Taylor just makes me feel so safe. I don't know why I ever gave it up. But Has this ever been mentioned before? No. So unless it's been mentioned in the past ten oh. years. Well, kids are weak, Mark. <laughs> <laughs> It's over. I missed Halloween. Wow. The stakes could not be high. <laughs> I've just raised the stakes. <laughs> I expected better behavior from Jimmy the scumbag. Why your kids cannot be unseen. It's naked, wasted for not Halloween. May not be the smartest dad, or the bravest, or the smartest, but I am great at one thing. So awesome. Eviscreen Terrence needs our help. We can get plastered and hit on a <laughs> Come on. Come on. Foolish Simpsons, this was not their typical Halloween experience. <laughs> so, your, your opinions of that episode? Yeah, that wasn't good either. Halloween of Horror was not as good as Prince of Pauper, but it was definitely better than Flanders Ladder. I'd still say it's not a good episode, and I'm happy to never see it again. It's not even memorable. I liked the, like, adult Halloween. That was had a few funny moments where you see certain characters dressed up. They could have done a whole episode about that, or had that be the B-plot instead of just there as a thing in the last five minutes. A couple of mild chuckles. I wanted to get something that was in the classic era, but 
the only things that had negative reviews were the clip shows. Yeah. So I thought I'd go for something that was still a bit more creative, which is this one. It parodies various types of, of television shows. <laughs> <laughs> Chief Wiggum, I can't wait to hear about all the exciting, sexy adventures you're sharing. Ralph's dead! <laughs> Bad news, George. He just shouted over Lisa's only line in this episode. How is Skidder so slow? <laughs> <laughs> He's gradually getting away. <laughs> you really are a love expert. Dang right. Fact is, I invented kissing. It was during World War I. And they were looking for a new way to spread Back in 19 dickity two. We had to say dickity, because the Kaiser had stolen our word 20. I've suffered so long. Why can't I die? <laughs> <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> Would you two close the damn door? Bart. But that's where we live. A damn. <laughs> Look, everybody. Do 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 do. Crack that whip. Licorice whip. Stupid sexy Smithers. Uh -huh. I generally thought was worse than Principal of a Pauper. Yeah. It was really good. It was definitely better than two more recent ones you've seen. The first part was the best. Oh, the, like really? it had a high and then it just slowly trailed downwards. We've all seen Disenchantment. Yes. The more recent yes. Matt Groening yeah. show. What do you think about Disenchantment opposed to what we can now assume is the latest Simpsons? Disenchantment's better. Yeah. Yeah. I think it's, it's, it's like fresh. Whole, yeah. Well, Disenchantment has also been met with a lot of like, eh, it's all right. No, it's good. George and I have seen a couple more episodes yeah. than you of it, and to be honest, I think the more episodes I saw, the less I was into it. I kind yeah, of thought I agree, they were yeah. running a bit thin. How do you keep The Simpsons fresh and funny after eight long years? They'll never stop The Simpsons. Have no <laughs> tears, we've got stories for years. The shocking revelation here that the old Simpson good, new Simpson bad. Two dramas better. Don't blame me, I voted for Zoidberg. Go! Boo or Boo Earns?